My name is Leontino Balbo Jr. I'm an agronomist and an executive of Balbo Group in Brazil. Balbo Group is composed by three sugar mills, two in Sao Paulo State and another one in Minas Gerais State. Lots of changes were done until we changed totally the profile of our company and our business. We switched 20,000 of hectares of cane sugar plantation from conventional technology of production into the revitalizing agriculture. So this new type of agriculture presented so very good results that we ended up becoming the biggest uh, supply of organic sugar in the world. We export to 64 countries and now also supplying uh, neutral organic alcohol for cosmetic industry. I do not see anything. The nature tells me what to do. What I am, I am an observer. I believe that the farther you want to go, the less things you have to take with yourself. That's what I do. I develop a technology, I profit from it, and then I go to the next one. And we leave that everybody else profit from that. I made myself open to the nature wisdom and suddenly I started seeing inside the forest like an infographic. Everything happening, the birds, the insects, and that everything was interconnected. And there was a very sophisticated system of communication. And I realized that they, they, all, all those insects were not attacking any plant inside the forest. But the same insects used to attack the canes. So why? So I started observing what used to happen inside that forest. And one by one, example by example, I learned, I started transferring to the agricultural area. There are lots of useful information in the nature that we can use to create the basis of a new production system which is less impactant, which is more rational and more efficient. We can observe that these are totally healthy leaves. And the reason is the focus here. We do not put focus too much on the crop. The focus is in the environment as a whole, in the ecosystem as a whole. The result of that is the ecosystem itself takes care about the crop. We don't fertilize the crop. We feed the soil life. And then they take care about the cane, about its nutrition, its Im immunologic system. And we don't have one eaten part, one bite, nothing, no disease in our cane, 20,000 hectares. Ecosystem revitalizing agriculture is an agriculture which at the same time provide all conditions for the crop growth with no problems with plagues, diseases, but at the same time providing to the environment the most important uh, environmental services like uh, preserving the water, in improving and keeping soil fertility, bringing back the fauna, biodiversity and absorbing carbon from other activities of the economy. One of the most uh, interesting results of the application of the revitalizing agriculture is the radical change of the soil structure. It was recovered in a such good level, high level, that the soils are even reaching um, a soil fertility class higher than, than there were before man started disturbing the environment. This is a structure, naturally a structure, rich soil. And it retains four times more water than a conventional soil. In a way that we produce 20% more of the conventional production without any irrigation. And the best thing is is this soil helps the water life cycle. 
These soils, they had capacity of infiltrating and storing water in six times, in a way that the water is enough for the crop to evaporate and then to be transferred to the, the clouds and also to supply the aquifer. So some measures show it, that the fresh water here in the farms, the streams, rivers, increased in 30%. Besides becoming more fertile and providing better yields, much better yields, the soil was rebuilt by the activity of fungus, bacteria, hundreds of different species of insects, and it now presents a resilience. Uh, recently, researchers discovered that the fungus uh, act as a natural internet in the soils. They are translators of the different way of communication among uh, vegetables, bacteria, uh, insects, and so on. We harvest the cane, take the cane to the mill, where the, mill, the cane is processed. Then we have the production of alcohol, sugar, and so on, electricity. And then we take back all the organic waste products. We take back to the field. And we use them to feed the alive forms. So in a way that we have a closed cycle and, and, and nothing is lost. Here we can see another important stage of the, the management. We are seeing Vinesses application. Vinesses is a very, very important uh, organic fertilizer. And we use the Vinesses, which is rich in organic matter, nutrients, to boost the soil alive forms activity. So here we integrate sophisticated harvesting technology with natural practices. This is the modern concept, concept of modernity for me, not the opposite. So we don't have to have everything artificial, synthetic or electronic. Our environment, uh, production environment, became a lot more resilient. The weather has been much more unpredictable compared to what it used to be before. But now we can get more tons of cane per millimeter of, of rain. So comparing to 30 years ago, we more than double. And compared to 10 years ago, it, this efficiency increased in 15%. One of the main concerns when we started was how are we going to measure the results? And then I went after Idonians institutions like Embrapa, University of Sao Paulo, University of Campinas, and I looked for people specialized in soil fertility, fauna biodiversity, water resources, and atmosphere, CO2 release, and so on. We have Lots of publication studies regarding how the soil fertility evolved here, how biodiversity evolved here, and so on. Just as an example, after a whole year of organic production, besides compensating all our releases, we extracted 45,000 tons of CO2 from other activities of the economy. So we are not just, just carbon neutral, we are carbon sink. So I foresee that we can, for instance, take back sewage, garbage from the big cities to the agriculture ecosystem. And in the same way we did here, we can feed the life of the soil with all the waste products of the cities, closing the cycle, turning it circular. I foresee a wide range of application because since it's based on a principle, we can find thousands of different ways of getting the same results.